Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to our live broadcast from Maxwell and Mills Cicada Club in beautiful downtown Los Angeles, California. America's greatest summer playground, where tonight we proudly present Ian Whitcomb and the Bungalow Boys. And now here's the man who all ceremonies call the master, Mr. Maxwell DeMille. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, Conrad Montebank. Thank you, Maxwell DeMille. Say, folks, how about a big round of applause for Mr. Conrad Montebank, our announcer. And also, folks, I'd like to let you know, coming up very soon here at the Cicada Club, actually, next month, we're going to be having the lovely Jennifer Keith and her high society boys, featuring, of course, the delightful drummer, Mr. Daniel Glass. Oh! Thank you, Mr. Glass. And also, next month, Christine Nelson and her Macombo Moderns. Oh! And, back by popular demand, the dancer's favorite, Jonathan Stout and his Campus Five, featuring uh -huh. Hilary Alexander. Uh -huh. And uh, next week, Ginger Polly and the Who's Your Daddies with special guest, Johnny Holiday. Oh, not such a reaction. Uh -huh. That's better. And the following week, Richard Alpin's Roaring Twenties Review. Woo! Yes, Richard Halpern has left the building. Well, I'm glad I told you. I'll do it in his story. Yes. And of course, July 26th, my annual 39th birthday party featuring Dean Mora and his orchestra. But now we've got a band right here. Isn't that right, Conrad Montebank? It certainly is, Maxwell DeMille. It's Ian Whitcomb and his fabulous bungalow boy. Let's hear it for them, ladies and gentlemen. Midnight with the stars and you. A one, a two, a one, two, three, four. And you midnight and a rendezvous. Your eyes have a message tender, saying I surrender all myself to you. Midnight, but a sweet romance. I know all my whole life through I'll be remembering, dear, whatever else I do Midnight with the stars and you Stars and you. That's 1934. 
written by the great Harry Woods. But now let's go to the 20s. We haven't forgotten we had a request for a tango. And right after this 1920s number, we are going to do a tango. But we're now going to do the famous song, Babyface. Baby cheeks and baby clothes and baby hair I'm raving about my baby now Pretty little dimples and dimples there I love my little baby, I love her goodness knows I wrote a song about her and here's the way it goes Baby face, you got the cutest little baby face there's not another one can take your place Baby face My poor heart is jumping You sure have started something Baby face I'm up in heaven when I'm in your fun embrace I didn't need a shot Cause I just fell in love there and let's not forget this great bungalow boys band they're all stars in their own right the great Chris Tedesco on the trumpet you can hear Chris all the time but you can especially hear him on a movie that we made called the cat's meow directed by Peter Bogdanovich you can hear Chris on the trumpet at, at the end of that film we're all the way through the film and who's a guy who's also in that film and is a star in his own right, Mr. Fred Sokolow on the guitar. <laughs> the greatest bass player in Los Angeles, the guy who teaches everybody, Tim Evans on the bass. The king of Disneyland and an Englishman like I am, Mr. Richard Gere, the real Richard Gere on the piano. And if you want to see more of us, all you do is to go to YouTube, and there are 200 videos of me up there and everybody else playing. And you can even see me taking a bath in a film that I made. Okay. And I, some of my fans of the other sex rather enjoy it. Okay, now, uh, let's do a quiet number now called The Gypsy. Oh, sorry, sorry. I completely forgot. 
we, we're going to do the uh, Amapola, the tango. Okay. Who are the tango? We have some tango fans here. Okay. Amapola. Oh. Right. Absolutely wonderful Latin dip. That is one of the greatest dips I've ever seen. That's a sheep dip. All right, now. What was the name of that song? I don't know. What is it? Amapola. All right, 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 right. We have a, a waltz now to calm you down a bit. This is one that I wrote, especially for the Cicada Club. It's the Cicada Waltz for all those who have birthdays or are going to get married or are going to get unmarried. Whatever you're going to do, this is for you. The Golden Wedding. I'm going to ask Chris to play the melody on the Golden Wedding. And get Richard to play a nice waltz entry. 
One, two, three, one, two, three. That's for all you lovers. And that was written specially for Max Wildermill's Cicada Club. Now, am I understanding this correctly? It was called the Cicada Waltz. Cicada Waltz. So it's all about dancing bugs, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, first, here at the Cicada Club. Right. Say, Mr. Whitcomb, yes. what do you have in store for us next? Well, I don't know. What were the dancers like? Maybe we should do something fast now. Let me just find something fast. Say, folks, you like something a little more peppy. They like to do the Charleston. How about a Charleston, ladies and gentlemen? There's no response. Oh, yes, a Charleston it is. Hey, okay. All right. That's it. The Charleston. You have to skip a few from Charleston. No, we are B flat. B flat. Yeah, we don't need You know. Okay. The Charleston with the bus. You know the word? Yep. Carolina, Carolina, at last I got you on the map With a new tune, peppy new tune, with a peculiar snap You may not be able to buck or wing, foxtrot, two-step, or even sing If you ain't got religion in your feet, you could do this dance and do it neat Charleston, Charleston, the dance is at Charleston Some dance, some prance I'll say there's a diviner than the Charleston, Charleston. Gee, how you can Charleston fog. Every step of you needs to summon you. I'm a telling you, it's the secret you stop. Dance, wing, dance, will be a back number. When you Charleston, Charleston, that's it. 
that dance is surely a strong but sometime you'll be doing it one time you'll be doing it charleston and made in south carolina oh. Is the Charleston some dance, some friends? I'll say there's nothing finer than the Charleston, Charleston. Gee, how you can just fall. Every step you do leads to something new. I'm telling you, there's no secret. You stop, dance, swing, dance. Well, there'll be a back number for you, Charleston, that old Charleston. That dance is surely a strong but sometimes you're for doing it. Well, you did so well on that. Maybe I should do an. I was going to do another fast number, but maybe we'll skip it. We'll, we'll do something slower. Oh, here, here's one that I don't know whether Regina's a, is she around still. Here's a nice slow foxtrot. It's all about living in Michigan, down on the farm, wishing you could fish again in Michigan. That's when they had farms in Michigan, before motor cars took over. All right. I was born in Michigan And I wish and wish again That I was back In the town where I was born There's a farm in Michigan And I'd like to fish again by the river that flows beside the fields of waving corn. Here's the reason why I want to go back. I want to go back. I want to go back to the farm. Wake me up at 4 a.m. I think your great big city is very pretty. Nevertheless, I want to see there, I want to see there, a certain someone full of charm. That's why I wish again that I was in Michigan.
Bless them someone full of charm That's why I wish again I was in Michigan Down on the farm That's why I wish again I was in Michigan Down on the farm I wish I was in Michigan I think that's what's called a shottish. Yes, we're going to do something swingy now in complete contrast. Uh, well, the cop on the beat is swinging, isn't it? Okay. We're going to do something swingy. Hang on. We're, going to, we're skipping a lot. Hang on. We're, squi we're, we're, we're skipping a lot of numbers. Hang on a second. I'm sk skipping all kinds of English songs that we're going to do. I want to get it. I double dare you. Hang on. The best. Oh, we've missed the best things in life for free. No, we can't. Let's do. Have you got a cop on the beat there? Yeah. Let's do that. A cop on the beat. Yeah, yeah. Hello. A nice, a swingy, a tempo. Have you got a cop on the beat? And a one, a two, a one, two, three. People in this lonely old world Who are the lonely three? The cop on the beat The man in the moon and me Around the corner there's a party upstairs Here on the corner are we The cop on the beat The man in the moon and me I go to my room And I open the door All I see is gloom so I go to the corner just to hang around some more I see the happy looking couples go by They're so in love they can't see The cop on the beat, the man in the moon and me Here on the corner are we, the cop on the beat, the man in the moon and me. I go to my room and I open the door. All I see is gloom, so I go to the corner just to muck around some more. I see the happy looking couples go by, they're so in love they can see. The cop on the beat, the man in the moon and me. Well, that's nice and swingy, I think. I could see you all swinging like mad. I'm just skipping a few. Do we want another tango or not? No. You wouldn't like a tango? Well, maybe we should have a waltz, except I have to go. OK, well, I, I don't want to do I double dare you too soon, because that's too fast. OK, OK, chaps. Yep. Go to underneath the arches, but don't lose. Dare you. Go to go to underneath the arches. We're going to go to Britain for a, a second or two. We were thinking of doing the Lambeth Walk, but I'm not sure that you all know the Lambeth Walk. But here's a, here's a slowish number called Underneath the Arches from 1932. And this was when Britain was in its first depression. And this is about tramps. Or uh, what do they call them over here? Homeless people living underneath the, the arches of the River Thames on the embankment. Underneath the arches. Written by Bud Flanagan. Here's the verse. The verse is not in rhythm. You'll have to wait a second. 
This is very touching. The Ritz, I never sigh for. The Carlton, they can keep. There's only one thing that I know, and that is where I sleep. Underneath the arches, I dream my dreams away. Underneath the arches, on cobblestones I lay. Every night you'll find me Tired out and worn Happy when the daylight Comes creeping Heralding the dawn Sleeping when it's raining And sleeping when it's fine I hear those trains rattling by Above Pavement is a pillow, no matter where I stray. Underneath the arches, I dream my dreams away. A little bit of Britain. We didn't do the Lambeth Walk, but one day we will. All right, let's skip. What's happened? Oh, sorry. Skip to um, I double dare you. I double dare you. Skip to that was, that was back. Why don't we go back? Purple haze? You're talking about. Did you, did you realize that I was a rock and roll star in the 60s? Did you know that? You didn't, you, did you know that? And I'm one of, the, one of the few people who's still alive and have a memory. I've not had their brain Swiss cheesed. I've not abused substances. All right. If I had, I'd probably still be a rock star, but I'd be a dead rock star. All right. So, I double dare you. So, nice intro. A two, a one, two, three, four. dare you to sit over here I double dare you to lend me your ear take off your high hat and let's be friendly don't be a scare cat say what do you care can't you take a dare I double dare you to take off your blouse I double dare you to not get aroused 
And if that look in your eyes means what I'm thinking of I double dare you to fall in love with me I double dare you Take off your blouse I double dare you To not get aroused And if that look in your eyes Means what I'm thinking of I double dare you To fall in love with me I double dare you 1937 Ian Whitcomb in the bungalow boy <laughs> Hooray! That's very British. Hooray! There's a lot, of the, a lot of power in that tiny little guitar. This is a, a, it's a ukulele, my dear man. Well, that explains it. Hello, folks. It's Conrad Montebank with a quick message from your pal and mine, alcohol. Oh. Why not try a tempting cocktail, courtesy of Max the benignly belligerent bartender up at our mezzanine bar? Just a few steps upstairs take you to a thirst-quenching land of delightful libations. Tonight, might we discuss the delicious panchita, made it with that once forbidden liquor, absinthe. Yes, that liquor that our grandparents fought so hard to become outlawed for destroying the brain of Edgar Allan Poe is now once again available for your consumption. See it prepared right before your eyes, thanks to our vintage absinthe fountain, used exclusively at the Cicada Club by Max the benignly belligerent bartender. And now, back to our program, featuring Ian Whitcomb and the Bungalow Boys. Thank you very much indeed, my dear man. My pleasure, sir. Well, this is a, a waltz, and it's a, a Latin American waltz. This was written by the great Carlos Gardel of Argentina. And this, is, this he calls Amore de Estudiante, if you'll forgive my pronunciation. Loves of a Student by Carlos Gardel, 1934. A lovely waltz.
beautiful waltz, I think you'll agree, by Mr. Carlos Gardel. Well, we, we haven't got all that much longer, so I'm skipping a few numbers so that we get to the really good numbers. I think I have to skip this um, mashish. And, uh, oh, the best things in life are free. That's such a lovely song. We can't skip that. Did you, did you get there? The best things in life are free. If Regina's around, maybe she'll join us on this. The best things in life are free. We'll do the walls out of the verse out of rhythm. What do they call it? Rubato. There are so many kinds of riches and only one of them is gold the wealth you miss remember this worthwhile things cannot be bought or sold the moon belongs to everyone where are you regina the best things in life are free the stars belong to everyone they gleam there for you and me the flowers in spring the little robins that sing the sunbeams that shine they're yours, they're mine And love can come to everyone The best things in life are free Gentlemen, the best things in life, they're free, oh, they're free. And even though California is bankrupt and the whole of America is falling apart, just as Britain did, if you have an empire, that's what happens to you, ladies and gentlemen. But remember, the flowers in spring are the robins that sing. And shine, they're yours, they're mine. And love, love, ladies and gentlemen, love can come to everyone because the best things in life are free. The best things in life are free. I wonder how true that is, Maxwell. Well, I know, ladies and gentlemen, tonight is free at the Cicada Club because each and every Sunday, no cover charge. And why, you may ask? Because we like you. You but made that, me pay $20 to be here tonight. That's right. Of course, that doesn't mean I like you less when there is a cover charge, like in three weeks for my annual 39th birthday party. No. And be sure to get your tickets because once they're gone, that's it, folks. And say, we'd like to turn the clock forward 
from the 1930s, about 35 years forward. What, right now? When do we finish, by the way, Max? Oh, well, Mr. Whitcomb wants to know when we finish. I would say you got about uh, 10, 10 minutes. All right, we'll do this one, and then we'll do the rock and roll stuff again. Very well. So, yes, yeah, so Mr. Whitcomb is going to play one more set, I mean, one more number from his regular repertoire of tunes. And then we're going to turn the clock forward, ladies and gentlemen, from the 1930s, about 35 years into the future. And you won't want to miss this. It's something you will not believe. And Mr. Conrad Montebank has never heard it either. No, and I'm very excited. 1965, the land of flying cars and robot butlers. <laughs> what robot butlers? That's right, the world of the future. And now, ladies and gentlemen, here he is. Mr. Ian Whitcomb and his bungalow boys, and hopefully someday when they grow up, they'll be bungalow men. Well, as Maxwell said, we may have to change the name of this band because we looked this name up on, uh, should I not say that? Okay, okay, well, we will, enough said. We won't say any more about the bungalow boys. All right, okay, now here is, a, we're gonna do a waltz and then we're gonna go into, we're gonna end with some, a rock and roll set, okay? So this is a waltz I really love called Rocker by Moon. You got that Rocker by yeah. Moon? Okay. All right. Okay. We're in uh, B flat. Sounding of the waltz. Give me that one. Reverse. One, two. Give me this intro. One, two, three. One, two, three. <laughs> rock a by moon from my cradle I used to watch you at night And though I've outgrown my cradle I miss the thrill of your light rock a by moon through the treetops Shine down on me as of yore Then all my tears will be wee drops And I'll be happy once more Bring me a vision of mother Crooning that rocker by tune if you'll appear, twill mean heaven's near, dear old rocker by moon. Bring me a vision of mother Crooning that rocker by tune If you'll appear, twill mean heaven's near Dear old rocker by moon And from 1932, we go to the 1950s Rip it up 
Well, it's Saturday night and I just got paid. I fool about my money, don't try to save it. My heart says go, go, have a time. But it's Saturday night, and baby, I feel fine. I'm gonna rip it up. Gonna rip it up. Gonna rock it up. Gonna rock it up. I'm gonna rip it up at the ball tonight. Now I won't be late I picked her up in my 88 She ain't going down by the Union Hall Tonight, night, night, we'll have a ball We're gonna rip it up We're gonna rip it up We're gonna shake it up We're gonna rock it up We're gonna rip it up Hack the ball tonight Go, go, go Night and I just got paid. I fool about my money, Lord. I try to save it. My heart says, Go, go, have a time. Saturday night, and I'm pretty fine. I'm gonna rock it up. Ooh, gonna shake it up. Ooh, gonna fall up. Gonna shake it up. Gonna rock it up. At the ball tonight. One more time, no, no. I'm gonna have some fun tonight. Have some fun tonight. Ooh, everything's good. Is that what the music's going to be like in the future? It'll certainly help me digest my food pills. I'll say and say, if we move the clock forward from the 50s to the year 1964, ladies and gentlemen. Ah, uh, when apes will rule the earth. <laughs> 1965, ladies and gentlemen, when apes rule the earth, and here's a prime example of one that learned to announce. Mr. Conrad Montebank, the trained speaking ape. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Ian Whitcomb had a very, will have a very huge hit in the future, in the year 1964, I predict. Is this our penultimate number, by the way? It is the penultimate number, yes indeed. The nadir of Mr. Whitcomb's career. Right. It ended my it, No, it didn't end no, your it career. Ended my career with you. Yes. It, anyway, enough yabbing. Ladies and gentlemen, by popular request, you have to hear it to believe it and pay to close attention to the lyrics. Here it is. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Ian presents You Turn Me On. Thank you very much. And if you go to YouTube, if you go to YouTube, you can see me singing this on Shindig in 19... YouTube. You, you can see me on, on, on singing it. Anyway, forget it. Here it is. Not bad for an old fool. So again, ding, 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 ding. One, a two, a one, two, three, four.
Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Ian Whitcomb. The man of class, charm, and distinction, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. Thanks. Yes, uh, so that's what they'll be doing in the future. Just a sneak preview. Yes. We now return you back to the present day of 1936. Right, and we're going to say, uh, chaps, if you can slip ahead, can you find Good Night, Sweetheart? I can't find it, but uh, maybe you can remember it without doing it. Oh, here it is. It's about six in. Good Night, Sweetheart. It's after, have you got it? Are you going to be uh, closing out with this number? Is that it? I'm, I'm going to be here, aren't I? In, are you so talking about being here? No, I'm just wondering if this is going to be your last number of the evening. Oh, sorry, it is going to be. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, last chance for your dance to Mr. Ian Whitcomb. But I'm going to be back here in December, aren't No. Mr. Ian Whitcomb will return to the Cicada Club sometime soon Good if we can uh, recover from that last number. It's a, it's a long way on. Thank you. There it is. Good night, sweetheart. OK. Well, one, thank you very much. You've been wonderful tonight. We love playing for you because we love playing for dancers and you're wonderful dancers. Thank you so much. So, thank you. Give us an intro. One, a two, a one, two, three, four. <laughs> Good night, sweetheart, all my prayers are for you. Good night, sweetheart, I'll be watching uh, you. Tears and party may make us for long, but with the dawn, a new day is born. So I'll say good night, sweetheart. Sleep will banish sorrow. Good night, sweetheart. Till we meet tomorrow. All your sadness soon will turn to gladness. Good night, sweetheart, good night. Good night, everybody. Once more, thank you, Mr. DeMille, for keeping the age of elegance alive. And thank you all for coming tonight to the marvelous Cicada Club. And I want to thank my wife, Regina, for singing with us and for taking care of myself and Rollo in the house. And of course, for the wonderful Bungalow Boys. So, good night, sweetheart. Good night. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it one more time for Ian Whitcomb and the Bungalow Boys. Thank you. We hope you enjoyed the band. And for now, we hope to see you in the coming weeks here at the Cicada Club. But now, this is Maxwell DeMille wishing you all the best of good luck and good evening.
Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. You've been watching a night at the Cicada Club. Join us next week with Ginger Polly and her Hoosier Daddies with special guest, the handsomest man in the world, Johnny Holiday. This is yours truly, Conrad Montebank, for the Dumont Television Network, wishing you good night and good luck. <laughs>